Hey everybody! Okay, with lighting for a second, I see if anybody wants to jump on here. I got a, I got a new setup in a new part of my house. I don't know if you'd call it a setup exactly. I just found out that my little ring light thing can be charged. Look at there, I thought I had batteries. So apparently I need to do that. So I wanted to do something that my friend Christy did because she's so cool and I want to be just like Christy Taylor. Okay, so she did a live video the other day. I can't believe she did a live video of um, layering a color that you love the tone of it with a lighter color to get a color that would work for you. So, Sheerberry is one of my arch nemesis because I love slash hate it. It's such a pretty color and it's my tone like it was made for me. I can't wear it though because it's so dark. So, I'm going to be like Christy right now. I'm going to start with a color that is too light for me. This is Cappuccino. Cappuccino. Do you hear that? That's my son. He's 20 months old today. So anytime you wear lip scents, you're going to shake, shake, shake the product. And see, a lot comes out. Um, the product is thinner than other lipsticks and lip glosses. And you're going to apply it really thin like that. So I'm going to wipe off most of the excess product to where I can see mostly sponge. I got clean, dry lips right now. And it's almost 5 o'clock. I never put on lips today. I mean, you know, lip color, whatever. So... Going to dinner tonight with some friends. That's pretty fancy in my world. So cappuccino is super light. I don't know if you can tell. So I'm going to do two layers of cappuccino. When you're wearing lip scents, you're going to do three thin layers and let it dry in between. And you're not going to go back and forth. You're just going to move in one direction. Christy did this the other day with Bella, and Bella's another one that I feel like I should be able to wear. Like, I don't know why I get a little bit personally offended about that, but I feel like I should be able to wear Bella, like it's the perfect color. I, I actually, before it came back in stock, I was like, this is my color. I feel it. I know that this is going to work for me, and then it just looks like death on me, so. Great tone. It just goes too dark on me. I pull a lot of um, brown when I wear colors. Any color, like, I feel like I could increase it by, increase the brown in it by, like, 50%. It's just going to look, like, dark and brown on me. Okay, so that's the second layer of cappuccino, which is a super pretty light color. It's a great, like, daily color for blonde hair, light eyes, um, opposite of me. <laughs> so that's my second layer. I'm going to let that dry for a second. Find a spot for that. So let me show you this. This is my lip kit that I keep my stuff in. I've got lots of colors, foundation testers, glosses, eyeshadows, blushes. So um, that's what I have my phone propped up on here. I probably shouldn't have un undone my rig. Okay, so then I'm going to do my third layer with the color that I actually want the tone of, which is Sheerberry. If I can figure out how I have this set up again. Okay, so Sheerberry is the color that I actually love and really want to wear, but it's normally too dark on me. So I've done two layers of Cappuccino, which is a lot lighter. Notice how I go across what looks like twice. That's because I'm getting the juicy part of my lip, and then I'm getting my waterline. It's like here. You want to make sure that you get that really well because it'll come off of there really fast if you don't cover that well. And make sure that it's dry before you start.
Do you hear Ethan saying happy? He declares that over himself all the time. Happy, baby. He doesn't sing it, usually. Also, see how that went a little darker right there, almost like a liner? I don't mind that. I could, I could go over it with a little oops remover to lighten it, but really what I care about is just that it looks even. So that's why I just took the tip of that wand and just lined it a little on that side. Like, okay, if that's what you want to do, lips, I can work with that. And now I'm just going to do the same thing on the bottom. Uh-huh. Just make sure your brother doesn't go out the front door. I feel like I say that 700 times a day. Make sure your brother doesn't go out the front door. He's so fast. He would be gone pecan if he went out that front door. Okay, also, glosses. Alyssa, make sure your brother doesn't go out. The glosses come in lots of different shades, so it's not just the glossy gloss. There's also, like, matte gloss, and this is one of my favorites. This is pearl gloss. It's a little, like, milky white. And it just kind of is a little bit thinner than glossy gloss. Um, any of the like specialty glosses, you kind of want to pump around. When it goes on, it has a little bit of a milky tint to it, so it can tone some colors down. But that works for me because now I can wear sheer berry, thanks to starting with cappuccino. So two layers of cappuccino, since it's a much lighter color. One layer of sheer berry. Pearl gloss, and I'm good to go.